So um, it was an ensemble. I mean, we only saw a couple of clips, and I have to tell you, I really like them so far, what we saw. It's like, oh, I want to see it now. But you see, it's really an ensemble effort and an ensemble piece of work, right? How did you feel? How did you fit in the whole ensemble, you two? Well, uh, my beginning, I was just thrown into the into the train and it was everybody there. So, uh, I don't know, I kind of just had to be there. And that was my first day with everybody else filming. And that was my first kind of acting day. And I just had to learn from everybody else what they're doing. And I learned from the best, which is great. But I sat opposite, you know, William Defoe and I just looked what he's doing, you know, when the action starts and kind of reacted to that. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. How was it yeah, like you said, you're kind of thrown in the, the deep end and day one we were in a carriage with everyone. Um, so I just felt incredibly lucky to be sitting among all of these incredible powerhouses of actors. So I think it could be intimidating. There's, like you said, Johnny yeah. Depp is there and well, you Julie just, Dench. You kind of Michelle sit Fight. there in silence, like, just don't mess up. <laughs> just don't say anything <laughs> stupid. Yeah, 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 yeah right. Really and also, like you said, it was your first acting day, and you said before on stage, um, in the moment you could move and you could beat the shit out of this guy, you know, you felt much better because yeah, 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 that's you can, what you know how to do, right? Yes, yes, I felt more comfortable and home with movement, you know, and I, and I, I mean, I wasn't trained to be an actor, I wasn't trained to speak, you know, dancers don't talk. So, you know, like, you don't know how to judge the situation, so it was you just go into unknown and take step by step and be really brave and be really try to be as confident as possible to to be good you know mm. to to do it right but you learned how to concentrate because when you go on stage and dance it's the same you know you have to yes. concentrate very much i mean i could uh, the only way this thing i could do is to use the same approach for acting as i used for dancing so that's what I did. I just stayed in a moment, in a moment, and uh, just took as it was, you know, mm. from my own feeling. Instinct. But that's why it was so amazing to be working with someone like him, because then sometimes with acting, it's like you're trying to force the moment, you're trying to portray mm. what you feel is right. Whereas working with Sergey, I guess you're mm. acting more instinctively. So it's just responding to the emotion and the energy just changes. It was unbelievable. So I was very lucky. It was interesting for you also to see that, right? Totally, because yeah, nothing imagine. is yeah. forced or synthetic. Mm -hmm. It's just very raw and real. Right. Mm -hmm. And also, I have to say, I only saw that small clip, but I think you have an amazing presence on screen. And you looked a little bit like a young Johnny Depp from... Did, did you... Uh, did somebody say that because you look like that? No, I just A little that. bit like, you know? <laughs> and I thought, oh, wow, that's interesting. And then you said on stage you would bank with Johnny Depp. So I thought, oh, that comes from there. No, I, I, I had Johnny Depp's poster for many years. I love Johnny. Okay. <laughs> so, like, <laughs> so you had it over your bed? Yeah. Or where was you at the poster? Of, in your house? Your no, you in your ceiling. No, it was. It was. <laughs> <laughs> Above my bed, <laughs> I'm not joking. I was hanging down like this, fall asleep with Johnny every mm -hmm. night. But I, I, I love Johnny, and I, I, I don't know. Just you know, when you're growing up, you you choose your idols. Of course. And Johnny was one of them, so it was really great just to see him, to hug him. <laughs> and were you happy? I mean, like not disappointed or anything to meet him, and you know, also to watch him work. You know, he's a yeah. That's yeah, kind of. That's what I wanted. I was running and, you know, looking how he does things. I'm just really trying to suck everything that I can, learn everything. No, it's, I mean, they're special and special actors are not just special because they've been promoted well or it's because they have amazing energy. An audience feel right. the energy from the screen and he has a present on in a live presence that ah. people are drawn to him. So mm. it's Very last question, you know, Ken uh, was directing and acting at the same time, and the main, you know, the main role in that sense, of, even if it was an ensemble effort. How is that for you actors, you know? Um, do you trust him more because you know he's an actor, he feels like you? 
It's definitely different to be directed by a director who has experience acting, especially when it's Kenneth Branagh, um, because they just they have the emotional instincts and understand where you're where you want to come from, and then of course have the overviewing image of, of a director and view of a director and it was incredible watching him work because you think I mean when it's a lineup of 16 of us there's no way he can possibly get to everyone but after every take he would come and walk down the line of all of us and give everyone very coherent and lucid direction very precise to each and every one of us while in his big <laughs> horror moustache and then go back to doing his best work so it was yeah. astonishing.